could explain the whole Kodak Black part. I can explain it easy. Huh? He's a real woo baby. <laughs> what did you guys think? Man, Kodak wiggle out the jam every time without bro, telling. Bro. Every time this nigga wiggle out the jam without telling, bro. I don't know how he do it, bro. He, he like you I said. I don't know how he got Ooh. parting because. That's what we saying. Woo he tell baby. you lie. He, he had a little, little baby, man. He had to go, he had a little, little sprinkle on there. You know what, if you know what we talking about. <laughs> you feel me? Kodak Haitian, if you know what we talking about. Yes, sir. I don't man. know how he do it, man. So, the whole situation with Kodak getting pardoned by Donald Trump is a good situation. And um, I don't see any um other reason for Donald Trump to want to do it. You know what I mean? So, it's kind of so confused. I get what you're saying. But, like, we might have had a real conversation behind it. Like, what do you think that was, like, for Donald Trump? See, he, he don't believe in, in the spiritual world. So, all right. <laughs> He, I'm if not he trying. can't see it, he can't. <laughs> so he don't think that that's real, but I know it's real. Though. So that, that's your answer. That's you believe it like Ooh, that. Woo, baby, though. All the, man, so say, on, bro. How else you explain uh, a 22 year old rapper getting pardoned by the president of the United States on some gun shit? It don't. I it, you, by the president though. It's not. Yeah. Just, Come on, like, pardoned by the president, yike, man. Project Baby. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Inform it. Hell no! Nah, nah, hell no! Nah. If he would have just, thing that I if he think just, of, but a foreman don't get pardoned by the president. A that's foreman what I'm don't saying, get a pardon. A pardon is different. Yeah, you feel me? So like, it's usually rich white politicians or billionaires that them ran the Ponzi scheme. Uh, president Obama pardoned a lot of the people that Hillary and Bill Clinton locked up for for nonviolent drug charges. Yeah, motherfuckers had to sit in jail for twenty something years and they ain't shot nobody, ain't robbed nobody. You know what I'm saying? I was just flipping a little coke. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Obama pardoned people like that where the laws are obviously outdated. A lot of people who got weed charges getting pardoned. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I think a lot of times a pardon, um, it it means you're not, you know what I'm saying? It's taken off your record. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So it's Forgiveness. just done with. Like, it, they can't come after you later on or nothing. You just straight yeah. and clean. Man, listen, Suki Hana said something too, dog. Like yeah, what she said, what she said. She said, I'm glad Kodak come home because a lot of niggas running off with his sauce, man. Mm -hmm. Listen, man. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a, man, he started too many trends. I don't want to get into it. I don't want the, the hate from the YB fans, but YB took a lot from Yike. You feel me? YB not even Haitian. I heard him on the song talking about my zombies. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a fact. Y'all can't argue with that. That little dance, why we got credit for it. Kodak did it first. That's a fact. Kodak did it first. A lot of people thought uh, YB was saying 38 baby because he carried a 38 pistol. No, he from 38th Street. 38 and Chippewa. You know what I'm saying? 38 baby, Project Baby. Kodak didn't invent the term Project Baby, but he damn sure popularized it and had it hot at the moment. Mm -hmm. You feel me? That's what, man... Let's get off YB because I don't want to turn the Kodak yeah, versus yeah, yeah. YB. But <laughs> the money spread, everybody doing it. I think I actually seen a, a challenge called the, the Shiesty Money Spread. Shiesty Money Spread? Man, y'all get that from Kodak. It's, it's even a video with Kodak going to... Brr, brr. I can't do it. How, how they do it? Brr. There it go. But yeah, that's it. Why right they spell it with an L? They try to say it with an L. It ain't going to go... See? Hey, I don't need sound right. They don't need no L in there. He got me uh. trying to say it with an L. It's <laughs> brr. You know what I'm saying? But... Kodak, man, Kodak did a lot of stuff first, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He set the trend. That's why he had to go pull the diamonds out and put the goals back in because you know, all the, the wave of young rappers getting diamonds in their mouth, you feel me? It was a few, like, older niggas, like, like Florida niggas or, or Louisiana niggas or definitely some Texas niggas that just had the diamonds in their mouth. But as far as young rappers in the game, once Kodak jumped, man, everybody started jumping out the bridge. That's why mm -hmm. he yanked them out, went mm -hmm. back to the goals. And I'll be damned if I bet your goal's finna come back now that Yike home. Nah. Plies got something to say about that. I'm talking about for the rappers that's going oh. to get diamonds in <laughs> their mouth. A lot of them going to be like, fuck, then I'm getting goals. You feel yeah. me? Yeah, it is a stuff right now. Yeah. Seeing the so homeboy with, doing that bit too. Yeah. With Kodak, with Kodak getting not, um, we all hope he learned his lesson, but do we think he has? <laughs> oh, no, Man, Kodak, Kodak, ever since Kodak went behind them bars, Kodak been I trying to come home. Yeah. You think so? I feel I like he kind of too. Because of the whole, you know, uh, Bill is real and everything. He rapping like that, so I think he. But I yeah, think he'll settle the down. The album he put bit. out after he got out the last time, he was going real deep. Mm -hmm. 
You know what I'm saying? And not even that. For me, even for me to feel like he learned his lesson, I feel like Kodak was kind of spoiled. Because like D said, like every time he get in there, he find a way out. He find a way out. This time he had to sit for a while. Yeah. And I think they, it was a little harder for him to just, just get out and come up with some reason to get out. He tried, then he tried the whole COVID thing. And then he tried the whole, you remember he everybody was, was getting out. Everything. He was trying all kind of shit. They were making his ass sit. putting something in his drain. Yeah. yeah. They, they beating him up. They had, and, he done sending a guard to the hospital and... <laughs> They they t- a lot of crazy stuff they were saying. Well, he was saying that they did to him. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And uh, every time something came out, I, I told you what I was thinking. What? Smoking Tucci in my cell. <laughs> 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 that nigga been on that Tooch tripping. Yeah. But do you, what you think? You think he learned his lesson? Uh, man, I hope so, man. I hope so. He was gone for a while. It's been a couple years. Won't won't call that back. No, yeah. won't need him gone no more, man. And you know what I'm saying? And then it's just a lot of people that was on his level or underneath him just eating, eating so much in this new money era. Like everybody got money and he's sitting in there. He missing out on a lot of money. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I think he finna come home and I think he finna change the game. You remember the last time he came home and you had people saying Glock 9 and Soldier Kid and Pootie, yeah, everybody yeah, yeah. sounding like him. And he then he dropped that project. Them niggas didn't sound like Yak <laughs> no more, dog. That testimony still goes mm-hmm. so hard. I still yeah. listen to that bitch. Well, yeah, man. Love the minds, I'm going blind. They, oh. they finna, they finna, uh, him and Jack Boy finna do some damage, man. Ooh. I can't wait for that shit. Him and Jack Boy finna do some damage. Jack and Yike. Yes, sir. That's what they should call the minister. <laughs> Jack and Yike. Yes, yeah, sir. Um, anything else we should add to this? Um, um, uh, just somebody else who thought they was getting important. They had a <laughs> yeah. They let Joe my boy stand up. Joe, Joe Exotic. My boy pulled up with the limo. They had the the doors going up on that bit. It was purple and green, like fluorescent lights on the inside. Champagne. So that, so they so they must have had information about yeah, but it probably didn't go through. I, he probably was just in consideration, and they jumped yeah. off the deep end with it. You know what I'm saying? I don't think I don't think it's just consideration you pull up like that. I think they probably told him yeah, and I think for some reason it didn't go through. Yeah. I just think because of, you know, the whole show, uh, Tiger King, how like everybody was on his side, had uh Cardi B and everybody, uh, I hey, think well, uh Did you Kim watch K. it? Yeah, I watched that bit. Don't it seem like they just set him up though? It yeah, don't, it don't they did seem set like up. he really it seemed like you know what I'm saying? It don't yeah. seem like he really paid them to go do a murder, bro. It just seemed like some shit they said and they all got deals out of it. They end up splitting his fucking park. Mm-hmm. His whole, you know what I'm saying? It yeah, just they seemed, all ate, so. It don't seem like he put money on Carol Baskin's head, the lady who fed her husband to a tiger. I'm not going to diss Carol Baskin's too strong because we in Tampa and she in Tampa she and she got tigers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What's up, Carol? <laughs> Bridging the Rap Podcast, man. Bridge. Um, I hope we didn't leave anything out, man. 